Yo, what up guys? New Pants here, back again with another Borderlands 3 Legendary Weapons Guide video today. Today I will be covering the 9 volt gun, which is dropped by Kilovolt in Lectro City. Now, the way you get this gun is by getting a quest from Moxie. And that quest from Moxie will basically say, I need you to go to this city called Lectra City, and I need you to participate in this battle royale, and I need you to kill a guy there named Killvolt, okay? So you will go through this wonderful, wonderful, wonderful quest, and at the end, you will fight this man named Killvolt. Now, Killvolt, by the way, is really, really, really hard. Like, Kilovolt is really, really, really hard, at least for me anyway, because I died to him like four or five times before I finally beat him once. Now, what you do in this quest is that once you kill Kilovolt, you take it, the quest back to Moxie and you complete it, and then you go back to his base, you exit and save, and then you go back in and just farm over and over and over. And as I said before, the weapon that he drops is the 9 volt. Now, this is a legendary electric gun that at the level 19 variant I got, it did 13 damage times 3, it had a 65% accuracy, handling of 70%, a reload of 1.4 seconds, fire rate of 15.02 seconds, and a magazine size of 9, and its blip down there was contact, plus 10% critical hit damage, and 2.2 times and 5 times weapon zoom. As I said before, it was a electric gun, and it did 17 shock damage and had 22% chance of dealing shock damage. Now, I think this gun is really good if you're going up against enemies who have a like for example the katagawa ball where he has three health bars and two of them are shields this gun is a must for that boss fight if you want to make your life so much easier but this weapon i don't think I, I, it's held back by how many rounds it has in each clip because it only has nine bullets in each clip and it shoots three at a time so you only get to shoot three times before uh, before you get to reload so that isn't very good but this weapon is really good actually it does shred through people it is very very fun to use and i personally enjoyed the weapon a lot but that was it for today guys it was a short little guide but i just wanted to uh get a video out to you i think that's it for today i think i'll see you guys in the next video Bye bye